Do you feel at odds with your body during perimenopause, changing metabolism, unexpected weight gain? You're not alone. I've suffered it. It's a frequent conversation in my Bloomer Brigade menopause community. It's even the most complained about symptom of perimenopausal patients nationwide. Throughout my personal menopause journey and through my published research, understanding the intersection of diet, exercise, and hormonal balance is the key to managing weight gain during perimenopause. Before we dive into these five solutions, be sure to click subscribe. And for a more in-depth exploration into menopause solutions, grab my free guide in the link below. I even invite you to apply to the Bloomer Brigade for solutions, weekly discussions, and your menopause community. Let's dive in. So why do we gain weight during perimenopause? Once we understand that, then we can look at solutions. During perimenopause, our ovaries slow down their production of hormones. This leads to lower levels of estrogen and progesterone. These two hormones have previously helped regulate weight, metabolism, and the distribution of fat. So as estrogen decreases, our bodies increasingly rely on fat tissue as an alternate source for estrogen production. However, fat cells are less efficient at producing estrogen. So how do our bodies compensate for the lower efficiency? They store more fat, particularly around the midriff. At the same time, our progesterone levels also decrease. This can exasperate the situation. Progesterone helps to counterbalance estrogen. It has a natural diuretic effect and it supports mood and sleep. So as progesterone declines, it leads to fluid retention, sleep disturbances, and increased stress, all which contribute factors to weight gain. Hopeless, right? Well, not even close. Science is on our side. And that's what this whole channel is dedicated to. So here are five solutions. Number one, let's discuss vitamins, minerals, and herbs for hormonal balance. Green tea stands out for its metabolism enhancing and antioxidant properties, which can be helpful in addressing metabolic slowdown. Spearmint tea is thought to aid hormonal balance by potentially reducing testosterone levels, which can become relatively elevated as estrogen declines. Omega-3 supplements are critical for overall hormonal health and may assist in weight management by promoting a healthier fat distribution. Additionally, natural supplements that support estrogen levels, such as black cohosh and evening primrose oil, may provide some benefit in managing perimenopausal symptoms, including weight gain. Number two, nutrition for estrogen regulation. A diet incorporating Phytoestrogens, which are plant-based compounds that weakly mimic estrogen, such as those found in soy or flax seeds, can help the body balance estrogen levels naturally. Phytoestrogens bind to the same receptors as estrogen, potentially easing the transition and the body's own estrogen production wanes. Additionally, a fiber-rich diet abundant in fruits and vegetables and whole grains is essential not only for weight management, but to maintain a healthy gut microbiome, which is linked to overall health and hormone metabolism. Furthermore, ensuring an adequate intake of essential vitamins and minerals, such as vitamin D, B vitamins, and calcium, are particularly important for menopausal health. Vitamin D and calcium are vital for bone density maintenance. Well, vitamin B minerals help improve energy levels and cognitive function, which may be affected by hormonal changes. Together, these nutritional strategies can provide a foundation to mitigate some common symptoms of perimenopause, including weight gain. Number three, exercise to rev up your metabolism. Exercise can be a powerful tool to counteract the metabolic slowdown during perimenopause. Regular physical activities can influence the level and activity of estrogen and progesterone in the body, helping to alleviate some of the weight management changes during this phase. So different forms of exercise can help. 
The first is strength training and aerobic exercise. Engaging in regular aerobic exercise, such as walking, cycling, or swimming, can help improve cardiovascular health and enhance calorie burn. And number four, healthy habits for weight management. Adopting healthy habits can have profound impacts on mitigating these hormonal effects. The first of these is consistent sleep. Prioritizing seven to nine hours of quality sleep is one of the most effective habits for weight management. Good sleep helps to regulate the hormones ghrelin and leptin, which control feelings of hunger and fullness. Additionally, adequate sleep can modulate cortisol levels, a stress hormone that is often implicated in increased abdominal fat when levels are high. Ensuring a regular sleep schedule supports the balance of these hormones, potentially reducing the risk of weight gain associated with hormonal imbalance. And also staying hydrated. Hydration is crucial for maintaining a healthy metabolism and aiding in digestion. Drinking sufficient water can also increase the sensation of fullness, which may help prevent overeating. Given that our bodies can sometimes mistake thirst for hunger, staying hydrated ensures that we're responding correctly to our body's actual needs and not misinterpreting signals. And mindful eating. Mindful eating involves being present and attentive to the experience of eating. Savor the flavors, but recognize hunger and fullness cues and avoid distractions during meals. This practice can foster a healthier relationship with food and with one's own body, reducing the likelihood of emotional eating, which can be a little more commonplace during hormonal changes. So pay close attention to your body's signals. Number five, community and supportive practices. Navigating menopause can feel lonely, but it doesn't have to be that way. You're not alone in this journey. Community can make all the difference. Picture yourself being part of a group like the Bloomer Brigade, where everyone gets what you're going through. In a community, you find more than just tips. You find friends who cheer you on. And here's the best part. In a group like the Bloomer Brigade, you don't just get by. You thrive, you get to try new things, and you're never alone. Embracing a community like the Bloomer Brigade during perimenopause is not just about finding support. It's about enriching your journey with shared experiences, stress reduction, and physical activities. It's a path to discovering a more vibrant, empowered, and balanced version of yourself during this transformative phase of life. The power of community and navigating perimenopause is undeniable. It's a beacon of support, knowledge, and joy that can make all the difference. By joining supportive networks like the Bloomberg Brigade, I've seen a profound impact on collective wisdom and encouragement. I invite you to become part of our community as we explore the beauty of positive aging together. Our next session starts soon. Thanks for watching. Below you will find the links for the Bloomer Brigade and also for the free menopause guide.